it is Thursday, December 2nd. I just woke up and journaled and read a little bit. Now I'm watching YouTube and for breakfast, I normally have overnight oats. I do like a third cup of oats, a third cup of almond milk or oat milk. And then I just sprinkle in cinnamon and pumpkin pie spice. My sister told me about putting protein powder in your overnight oats and I tried that and I literally hated it. Like the consistency was so off. I got a protein powder recently and I wanna start I do more protein, but I think they need to go in my smoothies and I don't yet have a blender. So anyway, I have my overnight oats and then I just cut up an apple and dished out some peanut butter. So that's breakfast. It's a little later. And the first thing I was going to do today was go outside with my ladder and hang the Christmas lights. I have a red strand and a blue strand, but I just walked around the house and there's no outside electrical outlets. So I don't think I can hang Christmas lights outside. I'll see if I can do them inside. Um, but I just got like a wild urge to clean um, given that I have work later today from 2.30 till seven. And although it's Thursday, today is like my Friday cause I took Friday and Saturday off. And then I normally have Sunday, Monday off. So I'm going into a four day weekend and I might go camping. So I really just want to deep clean the house and get rid of some stuff because it's feeling a little cluttery. I have a big bag of clothes that I want to take to Goodwill there on the stool. So yeah, I just need to like gather myself and i guess i'm getting really strong because i just went to pull out <laughs> the silverware and uh this scary looking part of the drawer came out so now i need to replace that drawer it's really old though so like fair enough i'd break too if i was that old um <laughs> anyway time to clean like actually enjoy cleaning. I just feel so much better. Like I vacuumed all the carpets and all the couch cushions. I also just scraped as much of the white candle residue out of the fireplace. I just have my two glass like stick candle holders now. So I just got off the phone with my sister while I was making lunch, which is also gonna double as my dinner. I really got into the salmon dish that went viral on TikTok. It's by Emily Mariko and it's like, salmon, rice, and then you can add veggies. Like I added broccoli, uh, orange bell pepper, and some avocado. And then you douse it in soy sauce and sriracha, and it just comes out looking like this. And it's so good. It's like, you've got your carbs, you've got your protein, you got your vegetables. It's just like chef's kiss. Um, but yeah, I think I'm gonna braid my hair before work and then head out. And I'm hoping that after work, I can go to anthropology. I live really close to the U Village, If you live in Seattle and know where that is. It's like a big outdoor shopping mall. And I don't need any more candles, but Anthropology just has the best ones. And I don't think I'm gonna get a Christmas tree this year. So I really wanna get a nice big candle, either to go on my kitchen table or maybe on the fireplace mantle or in between the two candlesticks that I just put up. There they are, so cute. Um, Cause I just want this place to smell like the forest. So hopefully I will do that after work and bring you guys along. So at work, I have this whiteboard where I write out the workout plans of my clients. So I have like half an hour and I'm just doing that before we start.
I am back home and I had a really good day because my shift at work went well and then I went right to anthropology and University Village was lit up with all its white Christmas lights. It's very magical down there. If you need candles, normally I do not shop at anthropology. It's not really my style, first of all, but it's also terribly overpriced. I feel like everything is super expensive, but they're having like a store-wide sale on candles. And I think they're mostly their fall collection because the ones I got are, I think, pumpkin scented, but all of them were marked down for sale. Like normally these candles are $24 each, but they were marked down to $9 and then they were an extra 30% off. So I got each of these candles for $5, so $25 for three candles. That's like a bath and body price for anthropology quality. So yeah, if you want candles, go to anthropology. The bags are just beautiful. I told myself as of today that I would stop collecting bags because they have too many, but it would make like a cute gift bag for the holiday season. So that's the bag it came in. And then the first one is a Capri Blue pumpkin cove. It looks like this or a pumpkin clove. And, um, it smells so good. It's probably why they're all on sale is because they're uh, not Christmas tree or like holiday scented, but I really like how the containers look. They're definitely worth keeping and like putting ponytail holders or like Q-tips in or something. I wanna learn how to like get out all the wax. I think there's a hack of like, you can put the very end of the candle. So when you've burned all the way down to the bottom in the freezer and then you can chip out and like clean it all out and you can keep the container. But yeah, I'm so excited. I think one of these, actually I'll just do it right now. One of these is gonna go on the fireplace mantle. So right by the actual pumpkins. Let's see. Yeah, that's cute. No, wait a second. <laughs> we'll do it together. Yeah, I think I... Yeah, that's how I want it. And then I will put another one of these, I think the Capri blue one, I will put this in the fireplace in between the two. Yeah, there we go. And then I think I will put the other one in the kitchen on the kitchen table. So yeah, they're all pumpkin. One is pumpkin clove, that was the Capri blue one. And then the other two are pumpkin and sweet vanilla. So this one will just go right there. Oh, love that. So anyway, yeah, really good day. And I'm going to end off the vlog here. I'm gonna turn on some YouTube and relax and finish my five minute journal for the day. And then I think I might record a podcast because it's Thursday, the podcast goes up on Friday mornings. And I wanted to talk about holidays, like the holiday season and why they're not bad as an adult, but they just get harder as you grow up and as uh, shit gets real. So tune into that if you're interested. Podcast is called Wendy's Waffle Bar. Then you can hear it on Spotify and Apple Podcasts and Anchor, basically anywhere that you listen to a podcast. And yeah, I will see you guys in tomorrow's Vlogmas. Bye.